Hey, what's going on guys? It's Ryan here from Game Essays and you see it there right on the screen. Breath of the Wild 2 has been delayed to spring 2023. I don't normally make these videos unless there's some big news and this is definitely that news. Clearly they needed more development time, but I think it also works to the game's benefit that it might be a little bit of a less crowded space releasing in spring of 2023. 2022 has been pretty insane with the amount of games coming out, and I think it will just be better if it does come out a little bit later. Plus, if they needed more time to develop it, then that totally makes sense too. I would rather it be a good game than a rushed game, and I think we can all agree there. So we have the delayed release date, but what else? What else? We got crumbs because as Zelda fans we just want anything one crumb of, of of new news and stuff like that but we did get a little bit more footage we got like two seconds of new footage so let's let's fast forward so we're seeing a lot of the stuff that we uh that we previously saw you know this footage here but we get a little bit more here so okay we get this new footage. You can clearly see Link has the Master Sword right now. He's got that corrupted hand. We see this little glowy orb. And then he's pulling out the Master Sword, and we can see it's like this corrupted, crazy-looking Master Sword. So this is totally new. It almost kind of looks like the, the Sheikah stuff a little bit, like the designs on the Sheikah pattern or whatever. I don't know, but clearly... It looks all corrupted and stuff like Link's arm here. So this is pretty, pretty wild. So this is about the extent of our uh, brand new footage. And then uh, we, we get more of uh, Anuma talking about some stuff. But he does say, um, you know, he says, take to the skies above. However, the expanded world goes beyond that. So we know people speculated maybe we get some stuff about like the underground. So we have above ground and we have underground. We don't know for sure yet because we know some of that intro cutscene or whatever we saw in previous footage, there was some underground stuff, but who knows. But it was nice to get about what, like four seconds of new footage here, this cool, corrupted looking Master Sword. I wonder if part of the game is going to be restoring the Master Sword. That's been a common element in a lot of a lot of other Zelda games but definitely let me know what you guys think hey the game's delayed but we got four seconds of new footage guys four seconds of new footage so uh thank you guys for watching and let me know what you think and I'll see you guys next time